The Duke and Duchess of Cornwall begin their annual visit to Cornwall today, spending three days in the duchy meeting local residents, business owners and veterans. The Duchy of Cornwall is a private estate established in 1337 by Edward III for his son and heir, Prince Edward. The Prince of Wales is the 24th Duke of Cornwall gaining the title on the Queen's accession to the throne in 1952. In 1969 at age 21, he became entitled to the full income of the duchy and took over its management. He is the longest-serving duke. The duchy's estate covers 52,971 hectares of land across 23 counties, extending further than the geographical boundaries of Cornwall, mostly in the southwest of England. Where will the Duke and Duchess of Cornwall visit during their trip? During their three-day visit, the Duke and Duchess will be attending events focusing on environmental issues and sustainability. Monday, July 16 today they will be touring local businesses in Fowey, meeting residents and representatives from the RNLI and Fowey Gig Club, as well as veterans of the Royal British Legion on Town Quay. Prince Charles and Camilla will then be starting off a gig race, a boat race in which there are six oarsmen women to a boat. Later in the day, the Duke of Cornwall will attend the Ocean Plastic Summit in St Agnes, a follow-up to the successful Ocean Plastic Awareness Day which occurred in 2015. The event organized by Surfers Against Sewage, will bring together key local leaders in business, innovation, and non-governmental organizations as well as politicians and stakeholders to discuss tackling ocean plastic pollution. Meanwhile, Camilla will be attending Cornwall Community Foundation in Listwithfield at the Duchy of Cornwall Nursery for the charity's 15th anniversary. Founded in 1998, the Cornwall Community Foundation was set up by a group of people who identified the need for a source of funding for the communities in Cornwall and the Isles of Scilly. The foundation, of which the Duchess of Cornwall is a patron, has since awarded more than £7. Five million to Cornish communities. This has supported more than 2,500 local grassroots organizations. Tuesday, July 17, the Duke and Duchess of Cornwall will visit St. Mary's on Tuesday, the largest island within the Scilly Archipelago. They will open the island's newly refurbished quayside as well as visiting the local harbourside restaurant on the quay and tour a local produced market and local sailing club. Prince Charles will also attend a Smart Islands virtual meeting at the Island Hall on St Martin's. In this meeting the Duke will hear about the work of the Smart Islands Partnership Program, which aims to tackle the Isles of Scilly's infrastructure transport and utility needs as well as providing skills, training and cheaper energy. Wednesday, July 18th on Wednesday, Prince Charles will visit St. Tudy's Community Shop in St. Tudy's, officially opening the shop's new extension which has in part been funded by the Prince's Countryside Trust, of which the Duke is a patron. The Duke will then visit a gate to plate food market, meeting local residents and food producers. This is the first ever gate to plate event in Honiton and will see East Devon's best food and craft producers selling their traditional wares on the town's high street, 